Hello, I'm Joanna Trollope and this is my latest novel. It's my 15th novel and it's called, as you can see, The Other Family. And the main theme of the book is inheritance and the effect it has on families. And obviously, if you're going to write about inheritance, you have to kill someone off. So I do that in the first chapter. I kill off a musician, a singer and pianist, who had his heyday in, I suppose, the 1980s. So he's in his late 60s when he dies, called Richie Rossiter. And the dynamic of the book is that he has two families. He has his family from his youth, his childhood sweetheart, whom he married in Newcastle, where he grew up, City of Music. And they had a son, his wife and he. And then the much younger woman, who lured him south with the promise of a completely new lung to his career in the south of England, by whom he had three daughters, who are now between sort of 18 and 22, but he never married their mother. So she is in a completely different legal position from the wife, even though she has lived with Richie longer than his wife did. And that is the trigger for the story. I think the idea of a will has always been a very powerful narrative device. And it's even more powerful now because families are so complicated and divided. There's so many step families. 15% of the couples in the UK are not married and they, as I said earlier, are in a different legal position from those that are. So the situation is more complex and more preoccupying than it's ever been. And therefore, from a novelist's point of view, a very hot topic. I think the element that might surprise readers with this book is that it has music to accompany it. Because Ritchie was a musician and his heyday was in the 1980s, a lot of his song titles are mentioned in the book, at least four of them. And when the book was finished, I said to a great friend of mine who is a really gifted musician with a lovely voice, he's a very good pianist, I said, Jason, would you, would you ever think of setting these to music? Would you ever think of composing the music for some of these songs? They have to be in the mood of the 80s. And he said, well, you know, you have a go at the lyrics and we'll see what we can do. So we have actually got three songs that accompany the book and I'm not sure that's ever happened with a novel before and if any of your viewers want to go to my website it's very easy it's just joannatrollope.com you can download the songs and you can actually see a video of Jason playing and singing the song that made Richie Rossiter famous on a very early Yorkshire television talent show a kind of a kind of precursor, if you like, of the X Factor.